Hey guys, this is Foolish Mortal whoop, Foolish Mortal 42 playing some more World of Warcraft with Valeen, our warlock, uh, Blood Elf warlock, of course. Uh, we are now in patch 6.2, uh, second week. Uh, kind of still working on some stuff on my hunter. Um, we'll get back to that eventually. Um, <clears throat> and we are over here. Oops, wrong button. Um, at the Bulwark from Undercity. Uh, we're going to be doing Western Plague Lands um, and probably some Eastern Plague Lands, uh, depending on how uh, how quickly I can move through this content. Um, I like the the little quest chain that you that we will be doing in Anderhal uh, on Horde side. It's pretty interesting, actually. It uh, deals a lot with uh, some um, some interesting things, yeah. So, um, but as you land here in uh, in the bulwark, you can uh, grab a couple of quests to do as you're running over there. Uh, foxes and hounds. These alliance forces walk around the plague lands like they own the place. Well, they don't. This land rightfully belongs to the Dark Lady. As the Battle of Anderhog drew to a close, the alliance forces occupy the plague lands scattered, occupying the plague lands scattered. Several of them can be found just east of here, hunting foxes. Prove to them that this is the forsaken. This is forsaken territory. So we'll get a bit of a ring upgrade there. What is it? Uh, and that's a low level one to hunt stuff on this side of the bulwark. Uh, latent diseases. I need plagued grass for an, an experiment of sorts. These Argent Crusaders and those infernal Cenarian Druids have done too good a job of healing the plague lands. However, and I can find... However, and I can find proper reagents and I can't find proper reagents within a reasonable walking distance. Some of the local wildlife retain the plague's touch, however. Kill a diseased black bear, then retrieve the grass that grows where its decaying body lies. It's not optimal, but it'll do. Dark lady, watch over you. All right, so these are uh, Argent Crusade. Uh, back in vanilla, probably late vanilla, um, there's actually quite a few quest chains um, uh, involving them, and uh, there was a lot of reputation grinding, lots of reputation grinding. Um, <clears throat> but it was now, it was uh, it was pretty fun. Uh, I'm kind of sad that they kind of took that out, but uh... oh, flame keeper, uh, we're not gonna do that. This is. Um, uh, the fire festival, summer fire festival, uh, it ends tomorrow. So, uh, and I had uh, bleh, talked about uh, some of this stuff. Uh, these time walking dungeons, which we can't do yet. Uh, you gotta be level seventy one to do them. Um, <clears throat> like they've made these dynamic. Uh, well, it's not technically dynamic because they're scheduled. Um, but you get uh, bonuses for uh, doing certain things during these overlaps. So, <clears throat> so like, um, let me see, a Pexus bonus event. Uh, let's see, that lasts basically all weekend. So basically, there's like a weekend event. Uh, actually, it goes until Tuesday. So that'd be cool. That might be something that uh, we look into uh, as we level up. So that's just a shaggy black bear. We don't need those. There's one. Yay. Uh, and these black bears... Um, <clears throat> Drop, uh, oops, but, um, um, 
they drop, I think it's bear flanks. Um, and those are really good for um, leveling your uh, cooking. Um, especially if you're like right around uh, like the late 200s. Uh, it's kind of hard to get Those last few uh, points in cooking. But of course, we're not going to be doing that. Uh, probably won't be doing cooking until we actually get to the garrison, so. It is sad that I have to kill everything, but, you know, sadness is for the users. I'll show you those, uh, a bear flank if we find one, so. Just uh, two levels away from uh, uh, two levels away from getting our uh, uh, another instant cast uh, damage over time spell. I'm very excited about that. killing things uh, much more efficient because uh, I can just like throw two quick dots on them and then uh, that'll be the end of it. There's one, the bear flank. Uh, you can actually sell them. Oh wow, they're going really good for in the auction house. So uh, yeah, uh, even if you're not cooking, it's worth coming up here and uh, grabbing them. I mean, I probably wouldn't, like, spend a lot of time farming for them. Um, oh, I love that. And I also found out something interesting. Um, soul burn, especially at this level, if you throw seed of corruption on stuff, uh, like when your uh, seed of corruption explodes or uh, detonates, I need to uh, target something. It will automatically put uh, corruption on everything around it. So uh, <clears throat> it's good. I would say that would be really good for uh, grouping up uh, big big mobs, uh, that type of thing. We generate uh, soul shards pretty rapidly, so I may have to work on a uh, some way to kind of have easy access to that. Maybe uh, figuring out which which button on my mouse to to assign that to. Maybe uh, I don't think it's. Uh, I've I've looked at some um, like in-game tips for. Uh, DPSing on a uh, Affliction Warlock, and they don't really use uh, Seed of Corruption that much. Um, there's uh, other area of effect type spells uh, that, uh, that they encourage you to use. Oh, sorry, I had to sneeze there. Uh, I am continually uh, plagued with... Uh, Diseased ones. Um, allergies this, this time of the year is really bad here, as I've mentioned. But 
but yeah, I, I apologize for not, not posting uh, anything last week at all. Uh, just been uh, really busy at work. Uh, and then my dad had some health problems and had to be in the hospital. And, uh, so I had to kind of go... Oh, wait, those spawn like multiple little patches. Oh, okay. I was thinking this is going to take forever if I'm only getting like one patch per uh, bear. Holy cow. So much for me uh, paying attention. But, uh, but yeah, uh, that's okay now. of something oh uh, something that really important actually happened uh, in real life I won't talk I don't tend to talk about real life too much or you know political stuff or religious stuff too much uh, but uh, if you live in America uh, this week is uh, something really cool happened uh, uh, the uh, Supreme Court uh, okay same-sex marriages and legalized it and that's really awesome I have uh, a lot of gay friends and you know that they can finally be just as miserable as the rest of us who have been married I mean that's just awesome for them so. yes that was a joke <laughs> no. uh, but it is, it's very important and I'm I'm often embarrassed by America, honestly. Uh, some of the stuff that uh, the rest of the world thinks about us is unfortunately fairly accurate sometimes. But, um, but I'm actually, you know, it made me kind of proud for a change. You know, it's just, uh, yeah, it, it's been a good day or a good week, you know. So, I didn't get very many uh, bear flakes. Uh, usually they're uh, uh, about a 20 to 30 percent drop. Uh, so you can come up here and kill like quite a few of them. cooking level up. I think you only need like 15 or 20 points uh, to get past, I want to say like 260 uh, on up. So, uh, you know what? I might do this one first. Because just, just to uh, uh, to get some easy Oh, I can't do that. What? It's a relief to have those hunters out of the way. We're not done killing a lot, however. So you can get a nice... Nice gun. I guess my Moggit is out of, uh, <clears throat> stuff's not showing up, but anyway. Uh, the men who kill, the, the men who till Felstone Field are no farmers, they're soldiers. The Saurian's forces needed food, so he sent some of the Alliance North from Anderhall to tend Felstone Field. The battle for Anderhall may be over. But another battle looms, Forsaken versus Human. Killing those soldiers that work at Felstone will give the 
Dark Lady's forces at a sad advantage. Dark Lady. Hello. Animal tissue holds on to disease so much better than plant tissue, doesn't it? Glorious, this is the last bit I need. Actually, stick around, Lean. Uh, let me tell you a little bit more about our plan. Who needs cauldrons? Have you seen the conditions of condition of Felstone Field? The Alliance forces at Anderhall have taken the area and they're using it to, to grow crops. I almost liked it better when the Scourge held the area. At least they had the sense to put a giant plague cauldron in the middle of the field. They're going to take that farm back from these humans, or we're on the field. Take these drums and place them at key locations around the field. I'll be waiting here at the board. a lot of intellect, uh, some stamina, uh, no other new quest, uh, we did get a ring, however, yeah, there we go, <coughs> excuse me, what is this fire buff? Uh, increased crit strike and fire damage. So we're we've got like a ton of rest and bonus. So we'll we'll actually level really fast. Um, actually, we've already got quite a bit. <laughs> Which is actually a pretty good, uh, pretty good dungeon. Uh, I think I've, I've showed that there's a lot of bosses in there, so and it goes pretty, pretty rapidly. So and running with the tank, uh, a pocket tank in your. Uh, Void Walker, it's, it's really handy. I did change my UI scale, so I'm hoping that uh, the recording doesn't uh, doesn't mess up too much. right spot there. Oh, you 
Let's stop the ranch house. Huh?